Alright, we have part 8 of the Lost CCG Files. Today's Lost CCG File is sort of odd as in, in terms of what cards are used in it. Hecatome! Yes, Hecatome, that's what it's called. Uh, who made this? This was actually made by Watsy, okay. So, this is another failed card game made by Watsy. Uh, a lot of them were made by Decipher, but this one's actually made by Watsy. But, uh... Here's what the... Let's see, when was this made? Go down here. Yep, 2005. Yep, there we go. I, my hands shake all the time when I'm doing this, so... I can't actually keep it straight. So... Inside here, this, can, this contains a deck of 40 random cards, one rule book, and a counter sheet. So, here's the front. Here's the back. There's the barcode for those that like that sort of thing. Hecatome. Hecatome. Upside down. There we go. And the copyright information. So, let's see what we get. Inside, these I'm guessing are damage counters. I could be wrong. Here's the cards. This is the rule book. Yeah, I should actually. Yeah, counter sheet. Here's the rule book. Keep that over there. And here is the pack of the deck of cards. As you can see, these are not. Normal trading card size. For instance, here's a Teen Titans card. I am going to guess that this is standard size. Here's Hecatome. These are not standard size. These are hexagons. These look like they're clear as well. So, let's open it. No wonder this didn't take off. And this is made by Watsy as well. Alright, so inside we have the cards. This is a the jester. Wow, these are these are thin. These are like these are like laminate or something. These are like plastic sheets. As you can see, this is a again Teen Titans card. Well it's just it's easier to better to show you on this. The card stock, as you can see, it's a lot thicker. This looks like it's practically flying away. See that one doesn't shake. That one shakes. These are these are very fragile I would guess. So the jester Great Cthulhu Breath Stealer. I do... The art is very... I mean, typical Watsi art, it is very nice. Needle Shaman. They do a very good job with magic. And they do... They did a good job with this. Ruin Sifter. Weretic. Yeah, Weretic. Weretic. Whatever. A Frozen Cephalopod! Cookie, if you get where that's from. Uh, reprocess. Fire overwhelming. Here's an interesting one. Baby blood monkey! Torment. Ghou Ghoulish reanimator. Gift of Hades. Five Space Interloper! There's a tame one. Food Poisoning. Midnight Snack. 
Okay, that's too tame. Forsaken Shell? The Butcher. Okay. Callow Believer. Yeah, the art really isn't that gruesome on these. It's just typical uh, Watsy art. Devo devoted One. Twinned Husk. Victimize. Damned Thing. By Hacky. Yofakwa. Greater Wolfling. Blood Monkey. What's their obsession with monkeys? Uh, Glimpse of the... Glimpse of the Cosmos. I had to read that. I can't really read it through the camera. Mindless Servant. Niberian Elephant. Crypt Caller. Suckling. Okay. Spirit of Fury. Surrounded by idiots! That's how I feel most of the time. When I'm in TeamSpeak, or whatever. It was only a dream. Creature from Zylo. Brain Surgeon. Winchester Blessing. I don't think it's a blessing with a Winchester. Hypersonic Fiend. And Alistarian. Jeez. I mean, the art is cool. I'm not. I'm not denying that. The art is very nice on all on a lot of these cards. Nothing really gruesome, although it probably wouldn't be recommended for too many kids. I mean, unless you're a parent that doesn't give a shit, which I can understand that. But I can see why this didn't catch on. I mean, these are very hard to store. You have to have a specific book and sleeve. I, I'm pretty sure they probably made sleeves for these, but, you know, if they didn't make sleeves, then I can really understand why it didn't catch on. But even still, you have to have specialized sleeves for these. You have to have a specialized book to carry them in, a specialized deck box. It, 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 no, 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 it just doesn't work. That's it, later.